All right, well, now we're overlooking the whole Ding Dong Dell area, right? Yeah, I'm in a new. I don't even know where this is. This is the top area I never was able to reach. This giant column of a thing. I don't even know what it is. What's going on, Raiden? Uh, so, so, so this is oh, it's Pride Rock. Yes, it's Pride Rock. You're right. I don't think I'm supposed to be walking over here. There's like a desert over there. I don't know if I can get to it though. You see it? I don't know if I can reach here if it's just scenery. So what's this stuff down here? I never reached this before. It's high up. High up area. I wonder if there's enemies and stuff. High, high level enemies? Oh god, level 53. I'm close to being able to handle that. But not yet. Oh, you know what? It might just be one enemy at that level. Because the other guy's white. Let's see if I can kill him. Things are going good this week, Raiden. Pretty good. Here goes nothing. Yeah, we got this. It's easy. Here goes. The axe is pretty good. I like the axe better than the hammer. Yeah, the axe is way better than the hammer. Way better. By the way, guys, stream's about to end. About another uh, five to ten minutes, and we're done for the night. So, anyone else got anything else to say or get in a message or, you know, anything to cheer? Now is your chance before I go offline. Come on! The Lightning God asked what was my favorite decade of gaming. I would say the 19, early 90s. A lot of the classics that I love came out. Not like the Super NES. Um, or... Early 90s, or I would say the uh, early to mid console life of like the last console gen, Xbox 360, PS3. There were a lot of great IPs like Mass Effect and stuff that came out at that time that I really enjoyed. So those would be my two favorite kinds times. Come on! What's up, Michael Burchick? Good to see you tonight. Uh, what was my opinion of Final Fantasy VIII as a Rapasaru? I hate it. I really do hate Final Fantasy VIII. I just confess the game. I, I don't like the plot. I don't like the combat. I don't like anything about it. The only thing good about the game is the graphics. That's it. <clears throat> Grab all this shit. Yeah, we're whooping these guys' asses. This isn't a big deal. This guy probably is too high level, I bet. Let's find out. Fifty-four, too high level. Maybe later. There's nothing else here. Nah. Just that rare monster. That's it. Okay. L Blue Knight should be five dollars. This is can you unblock me on Twitter? It was just Let's a funny gif. I have no idea what you're talking about. What are you, dude? Who are you and what are you talking about? <laughs> you know, it's, I, the one thing that I find hilarious is that a lot of people ask me to unlock them on various things. Ninety-five percent of the time, the person never tells me their name. So this guy took me five dollars to be unblocked on Twitter, asking if he can. Doesn't tell me his name. I can't unblock you if I don't know what your name is, dude. I need to know your name, then I'll look into it. Alright. Right, Master Sorg says, dude, just send an email. Right, just send me an email, I can look Watch into your it. Backs. <laughs> Thank you, Lightning God. This is my final cheer. Thank you, Phil. Stay positive. Thank you, Lightning God, for the support tonight. Hope you like the stream. I did. I'm having a lot of fun. I love I love open world exploration. I do. So I'm having a lot of fun going into these optional areas and figuring stuff out. This is fun to me. A lot of fun.
So there was one. There's actually another one over here. Look, see this? There's a whole other area up here. What the hell is this? There's another cradle. Yeah. This was be the cradle for Ding Dong Dell's uh, Kingmaker. The cradle of creation. Baby Man Gaming Tree says he's still broadcasting. Yeah, I'm about to finish, though. Yeah, this is for Oakenheart, Ding Dong Dell, see? I bet I gotta do all these later. I almost guarantee it. Gizpi is really cool, too. Do you have a, a, a favorite guilty pleasure game? A game that you know is bad but still enjoy? Ugh. Shit. <laughs> a game that I know is bad but I still love playing? I don't know. At least nothing is, is coming to mind right now. Maybe some people would 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 know, based on the things I have played over the years. But I, nothing is really popping into my head right now. That's where I came out of at the very beginning of the game, right? Yeah, right there. I think. Right? Am I right? Or am I wrong here? There's Ding Dong Dell. Maybe not. Hold on. What is this? Hey. It's too dangerous to land in near Ding Dong Dell. They won't let me. I don't think I did this before. It's a shrine. Tumble Down Shrine. What level of the monsters? 45. Alright. Let's go into Tumble Down Shrine. This will finish the, se the session. PUBG comes to mind. Says, what pasta do you prefer? I mean, the thing is, I don't really like PUBG that much. I love playing PUBG because I get to talk with you guys. It's not the game itself that's a pleasure to play. It's interacting with you guys during a game that has some suspenseful build-up moments. So, yes, Raiden, I definitely would recommend this game. Absolutely. I really like this game. Oh, good luck, everyone. <laughs> Level to, yeah, I, I'm absolutely destroying them and they're barely hurting me. Show us what you got. Cool. Items, 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 items. I got a Yeti's tooth. <laughs> a Yeti's tooth. Okay. Baby Man Gaming asks, do I get tired of playing video games? Honestly, not really. I think the reason I don't is because I play such a variety. You know what I mean? If I would, like I've told you guys, the reason I don't want to be a pro player in like fighting games or whatever, I think if I only played one style of game, I would get really tired of it. But because I play a variety, I think that's why I don't get bored. Thank you so much for being part of the coming up on which curse has been placed. I have one. Your first thing may be to discard such items, but you must not take the mistake of being so hasty. Curses can be removed through the process of purification. It's a worthwhile procedure to be sure if an item is rude to take on board a curse, as rude to be imbued with a skill. As to the details of how it can be performed, that would be a question better asked to another. I'm in the business of making curses, not removing them. So apparently that cursed Yeti suit that I got, I can remove the curse and add a skill later. Probably something I have to, uh, I have to research, I would bet. A rare monster. What level is it? It's huge! Oh my god, look at the size of this guy. 58. I'm not fighting him. Damn. 58. <laughs> Alright, let's finish up this cave. Another one of these big dudes. Look. Last time I whooped his ass, though. I'm just gonna fight this fucker. Oh, we were. Yeah, we're hurting it. Like this. 
just gotta be careful about what we're doing. We'll beat it. Yeah, see, we got healing going. We got stuff going. Ow! That really hurt. Yes, I played Medieval 1. Yes, is really cool. I, I think they had a sequel. I never played the sequel. But I played Medieval Part 1. Back in the day. Oh, wow. Here we go. This guy's bone now. Watch this. It's turret time, baby. Behold the power of 500 turrets coming for you. Keep doing it. Four. Five. Nothing. Turns like into shit. Wow, what a waste of time. All right, now they're shooting. That was good damage. He got stuck. He tried to charge. He got stuck. You saw that? What a mess. This is a mess. Maybe we're giving some good old entire playing video games for a little I change jobs. I mean, I don't know how long this is going to be viable. Right now, it's still viable for me. I don't know how much longer it will be. I'll have to find out. Right now, I made more money doing this than I would be doing any other job, so. I love you, little guy. I love you, little guy. Alright, he's down to half life. How do you like this? Oh, he knocked my beagle to your jerk. Give me super cavity right now. Wow, okay, that was totally unfair. That was completely, totally unfair. Come on. Alright. I can finish this, we're done for the night. I gotta beat him. Ridiculous spell this guy had. Lightning, crazy lightning spell. He's almost dead. I love you, little guy. I love you, little guy. Good damage right there. He ran away. He did. He ran away. He caught him with that spell, though. He's done. He's about to die. Any second now. Say goodnight. Oh. Oh. Done. Pretty cool. I like these new enemies that I'm running into. These big-ass enemies now. They're fun to fight. And not super challenging. An elite warrior's ring, huh? Let's see what the elite warrior's ring does. What the fuck is it? <laughs> Melee strikes boosted with HP is low. That's terrible. Um, DSP is really cool. Is asking what's the process to submit fan art. You gotta go to thekingofhate.com, which is my website. Okay. And once you go to the website, there's a forums. Go to the forums. In the forums, there's a general section where there's a section that actually says fan art. And there's a thread there that says Phil's return to Twitch and streaming. He needs fan art and stuff. You'll see tons of people have posted up fan art there. That's where you can post it up. That's the thread where I review fan art and uh, accept it for submissions, okay? 
All right. Popsicola just linked it in the stream chat, by the way. You just click on that. <laughs> All right. So, one final party, and then we can get out of here. Good luck, and then, time to call it quits for tonight. I just leveled up again. Nice. Pierce by Hiro asks, do I think I still have the reaction time to be a pro gamer? I mean, I, I still have really good reaction time. For example, if you take a look at uh, me playing Call of Duty recently, me playing Ultra Street Fighter 2 recently, I still have it. If someone jumps at me, I know I could do an anti-air. You know what I mean? Um, the problem is, it's it's not often anymore where you get a game without so much lag online that the reaction time really is... Uh, it's negated. You know what I mean? A lot of these games, you can't even do reactionary gameplay. Uh, because the lag is so bad online, so. Alright. Very good. That was Tumble Down Shrine. I know to come back here later, right? If I want to fight uh, another guy. And it looks like that. There's another one over there. Hideaway Hollow. No, that's where I came from earlier. I wonder if I can kill that guy straight ahead. I don't know. Hmm. Interesting. Alright, well. Exploration continues. Open world exploration with the airship. Good stuff. 